Hello everyone! Welcome to Math Corner. In this video, we will discuss the end behavior of the graphs of polynomial functions. Our goal is to determine the end behavior of the graph of a polynomial function. Let us begin. The end behavior of a polynomial function p of x is the behavior of the graph of p of x as x approaches positive infinity or negative infinity. To determine the end behavior of the graph of a polynomial function, we will be using the leading coefficient test. We will check if the degree is odd or even. We will also check if the leading coefficient is positive or negative. Let us have some examples. Example number 1, p of x equals 4x cubed plus 12x squared plus 5x minus 6. In this example, the leading term is 4x cubed. It is a polynomial of odd degree. The leading coefficient is positive. Example number 2, f of x equals negative x cubed minus 7x squared minus 14x minus 8. In this example, the leading term is negative x cubed. It is a polynomial of odd degree. The leading coefficient is negative. Example number 3, g of x equals negative 3x squared minus 8x minus 4. In this example, the leading term is negative 3x squared. It is a polynomial of even degree. The leading coefficient is negative. Example number 4, h of x equals x raised to 4 minus 2x cubed minus 4x squared plus 8x. In this example, the leading term is x raised to 4. It is a polynomial of even degree. The leading coefficient is positive. Using these four cases, let us discuss the end behavior of the graph of polynomial function. Case number 1, if the degree of the polynomial function is odd and the leading coefficient is positive, the graph falls to the left and rises to the right. Let us consider p of x equals x cubed plus 2x squared minus 4x minus 8. Since the degree is odd and the leading coefficient is positive, the graph falls to the left and rises to the right. As x approaches negative infinity, p of x approaches negative infinity. As x approaches positive infinity, p of x approaches positive infinity. Case number 2, if the degree of the polynomial function is odd and the leading coefficient is negative, the graph rises to the left and falls to the right. Let us consider p of x equals negative x raised to 5 plus 2x raised to 4 plus 3x cubed minus 4x squared minus 4x. The graph rises to the left and falls to the right. As x approaches negative infinity, p of x approaches positive infinity. As x approaches positive infinity, p of x approaches negative infinity. Case number 3, if the degree of the polynomial function is even and the leading coefficient is positive, the graph rises to the left and rises to the right. Let us consider p of x equals 2x squared minus 7x minus 4. The graph rises to the left and rises to the right. As x approaches negative infinity, p 
of x approaches positive infinity. As x approaches positive infinity, p of x approaches positive infinity. Case number 4, if the degree of the polynomial function is even and the leading coefficient is negative, the graph falls to the left and falls to the right. Let us consider p of x equals negative 3x raised to 4 plus 10x cubed minus 3x squared minus 12x plus 4. The graph falls to the left and falls to the right. As x approaches negative infinity, p of x approaches negative infinity. As x approaches positive infinity, p of x approaches negative infinity. Next, let us determine the end behavior of each of the following polynomial functions. Number 1, p of x equals x cubed plus 5x squared plus 6x. Since the degree is odd and the leading coefficient is positive, the graph falls to the left and rises to the right. Number 2, f of x equals negative 6x raised to 4 plus 3x cubed plus 30x squared. Since the degree is even and the leading coefficient is negative, the graph falls to the left and falls to the right. Number 3, g of x equals negative 10x cubed plus 43x squared minus 41x minus 10. Since the degree is odd and the leading coefficient is negative, the graph rises to the left and falls to the right. Number 4, y equals 8x squared minus 18x minus 5. Since the degree is even and the leading coefficient is positive, the graph rises to the left and rises to the right. We are done discussing the end behavior of the graphs of polynomial functions. That's all for this video. Thank you for watching.